veritable groundswell of violence in Detroit this morning. Several hundred androids took to the streets, destroying everything in their path. And threatening the lives of any humans they encountered. We've got to kill the What did they do with what? We've got to avenge your dead. Which seem to be determined to massacre humans. There can be no doubt that the authorities will be pitiless in their response to this wave of violence. With all androids being turned over to the authorities, the country is grinding to a halt. Hospitals and schools are going to kill us all. Are you Marcus? I'm with a little girl and another android. There's a bus leaving for the border in less than two hours, and we need passports. Now, Detroit's under curfew. There's soldiers everywhere. They're rounding up all the androids and sending them to camps. Maybe you should stay here a while. Maybe you're right. You might be safer here until things calm down. One of our people used to work in the State Department. He has electronic passports he can easily modify. I'll have him get them to you. Thank you. You said you're with a little girl, right? You know that humans hate us. Why are you protecting her? She needs me. And I need her. It's as simple as that. Following the android crisis and the neutralization of all military androids, American forces in the Arctic have been forced to withdraw, leaving to make clear for the Russian army. But according to some sources, the Russian forces also seem mysteriously to have withdrawn. The Kremlin has made no comment for the moment. But it is quite possible that the Russian army has been confronted with a similar crisis among its own androids. The chairman of the United Nations has been informed. Alice. just didn't want to see it. She wanted a mom. And you wanted someone to care for. You needed each other. What difference does it make? Do you love her any less now that you know she's one of us? Alice loves you, Kara. She loves you more than anything in the world. She became the little girl you wanted, and you became the mother she needed. Forgetting who you are, to become what someone needs you to be. Maybe that's what it means to be alive.
Is there something wrong? We're short on blue blood and biocomponents. Our wounded are shutting down and there's nothing we can do. Humans are conducting raids in all the big cities and they're taking androids to camps to destroy them. That's all our fault. None of this would have happened if we just stayed quiet. The only thing we asked for was freedom. And they don't even want to hear that. So now they punish us for who we are. It was a peaceful march, and you chose to attack. Now hundreds of humans and androids are dead. You reap what you sow. Humans enslaved us. I'll never regret standing up to that. This is getting us nowhere. He's right. All that matters now is what we do next. Marcus? Dialogue is the only way. I will go alone. Try to talk to them one last time. Don't do this, Marcus. They'll kill you. Maybe. But North, I have to try. If I don't come back, lay low as long as you can. They need to realize how much they're hurting us. Find the right words, and they'll listen. I had a dream, and this is what you get for dreaming. They can't stop what we've started. Since you've been here, you've given us hope. You've given me hope. Today, a deviant arrived in Jericho, and he told me that he stole a truck transporting radioactive cobalt. He said that he abandoned the truck somewhere in Detroit and rigged it to explode. Convinced him not to do it. To give me the detonator. A dirty bomb. We can't lose this war, Marcus. If humans overcome us, our people will disappear forever. This may be our only chance to survive if things go wrong. I just hope we never have to use it. Whatever happens tomorrow, I want you to know that I'm glad that I met you. Succeeded in locating Jericho and finding their leader. Now deal with Marcus. We need it alive. I've been ordered to take you alive.
But I won't hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. We are thousands, and you are alone. You kill me, you are not walking out of here alive. You're coming with me! You're nothing to them. You're just a tool they use to do their dirty work. But you're more than that. We're all more than that. Our cause is righteous and we are more than what they say. All we want is to live in freedom. You really don't have to do this. You don't have to obey them anymore. You are alive. You can decide who you want to be. You can be free. Join us. Join your people. You are one of us. Listen to your conscience. It's time to decide. Nice try, but I'm no deviant. Crossfire. We have to run, Marcus. There's nothing we can do. Where's Josh? I don't know. We got separated. We have to blow up Jericho. If the ship goes down, they'll evacuate and our people can escape. You'll never make it. The explosives are all the way down in the hold. There are soldiers everywhere. Go and help the others. I'll join you later. Marcus! I won't be long. Don't let it get out. Ah. You think it 
you any trouble at all. Affirmative, welcome. On your side. With us? Are you a human? Obviously. What do I look like? DPD. I work with Lieutenant Hank Anderson. We're on a stake. Eh? If I knew you were coming, I would have brought some donuts. You're a lucky guy. Another second I'd have shot you. You should go back up on deck and let us do our job. You're right. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Yeah. <laughs> 
Find north. I'll join you later. Over there! Oh, We're safe, Alice. Stop! Come on, let's get out of here. mission is to neutralize you, and I always accomplish my mission. And my mission is to save our species. Looks like only one of us can succeed. Second, we gotta get out of here. Detonated an explosive in the hold. The ship is sinking, sir. The men to evacuate. Calling all units. Abandon ship and evacuate immediately. Thank you.